Bowling. On September 9th, 1895, the modern standardized rules for 10-pin bowling were established in New York City by the new American Bowling Congress, the ABC. The scoring system capped out at 300 points per game and bowlers were allowed a maximum of a 16-pound ball during play. Since then, the great game of bowling has transformed dramatically with the introduction of new technology when it comes to the composition of bowling balls. They went from the Caribbean hardwood to rubber in 1905. Plastic balls were introduced in 1960, and in 1980, urethane shell bowling balls were introduced by Ebonite. In 1992, reactive resin bowling balls were introduced, causing perfect 300 game scores to increase by 20%. Despite the radical changes in bowling balls over the years, the lanes and pins have remained the same. You have to throw your ball 60 feet to knock down 10 pins that weigh 3 pounds 6 ounces each. If you do this 12 times in a row in a given game, you will have achieved perfection. Bowling a 300 game is a rush that is difficult to describe. I have only done it once and it was achieved in a very difficult environment. The year was 2003, and I was in a Bud Light-sponsored Cosmic Bowling League in Michigan. This means that there is little to no lighting other than black lights and strobe lights. There is a live DJ and everybody is drinking. After bowling the first nine strikes, I stepped up in the 10th frame and my heart was racing. I could not slow it down. My heart knew the extreme importance of this moment. By word of mouth, the rest of the league knew I was three strikes away from perfection. The whole league stopped bowling to watch. The DJ put on Eminem's Lose Yourself, a popular hit at the time. I can still remember mouthing the words as I threw strike number 10. The league cheered, but I knew I had to stay focused. The 11th shot, I pulled slightly and it came up high on the head pin. I thought I was going to leave a split, but by an act of God, all 10 pins fell. Knees weak, arms heavy. I threw my 12th shot and as soon as it left my hand, I knew it. Perfect spin, perfect speed, perfect angle to the pocket. I turned around and threw my arms up in celebration as my team rushed the lane to hug me and give me numerous high fives. Kelly Clarkston immediately came on and the song was a moment like this. Well played, DJ. Well played. As a side note, in the pre-league day one meeting, bowlers voted on if they wanted this to be a sanctioned league. This would mean that everybody would be responsible for a one-time $10 fee to make it official and players could win awards for high games and high series, etc. Since most of the bowlers were true recreationals, they voted against making the Bud Light Cosmic Bowling League sanctioned. This means that my 300 game did not officially count and I did not get a 300 ring. I am now in two sanctioned bowling leagues in Las Vegas. I maintain a 205 average in both of them. It is just a matter of time before I achieve that level of euphoria again. This time I will have it on video and I will get my ring.